Hey, what's up everyone? So welcome back to another video and today I'm going to show you the cheapest way to add Bluetooth to your car and even SD card with this tool right here. So let's check it out. Now that I'm editing the video, uh, I hear some noises and those noises are not from the adapter or from the radio system. Those noises are from my phone coming to the camera itself because to receive a message you kind of hear that kind of, of noise in radio systems in, in home sometimes maybe in the car but when, when I was filming this video there was no noises like there is noises uh, on the video and you will see those noises like come they come and go uh, but definitely they're not from the radio system or from the adapter itself so just a note there, because those noises sometimes are creepy as fuck. Well. First of all, you're gonna need AUX button on your radio system. If your radio system has the AUX button, but you don't have the cable, here's my cable. My radio system has the AUX button, but it wasn't coming with the cable, so I had to purchase the cable, take the radio out and install the AUX behind the radio. And then I, I brought my AUX cable through this panel right here to hide the AUX cable I just place it here and close the tray and it's closed nobody knows about it of course with this AUX cable you can plug in your phone use your phone directly with the AUX cable but you have always to kind of plug in your phone there some people don't want that they just want through Bluetooth or have the SD card reader which which this tool right here has the SD card reader which I can play music from SD card directly through AUX. Here has the AUX out port which I just plug in here, plug in uh, directly and it will play into the radio and in the front has the skip music and forward music and the play and pause music and as well answer a call and as well if you long press this button it will switch between Bluetooth mode and SD card reader. Now if your car doesn't have AUX button and even the AUX cable then the easiest way for you it will be uh, this kind of car adapters which this one doesn't have but uh, just to give you an idea I'm gonna show you on the screen which is gonna send the signals through the radio so you're gonna have to go in the radio and choose um, for example 900 FM and here on this uh, tool as well 900 FM for example just an example and connect your phone with this tool then this tool it will send the signals to your radio through radio of course but whenever you go into tunnels for example uh, you're gonna feel uh, the radio not like picking up good sound it's gonna be like shh and the best way is of course through AUX so if you have AUX then this is a must for you then you're gonna need an USB port to plug it in and like not charge but power it up in some cars you just need to have this uh, USB charger plugged in and whenever you like you take the keys out uh, the USB charger will, will turn off and when you turn your key in then the USB charger will turn on. My car doesn't have this feature, my car has the socket always on, I have to push it in to turn it on and slightly take it back to turn it off. I, of course I can take it always off and put it always in but that's more a pain in the ass. Plug in my USB my USB adapter, then plug in uh, the AUX cable into it. Now let's turn the radio on. Go to AUX. Play by TF card. Play by TF card. Or if I press Bluetooth the button, mode. Bluetooth mode. And like I said, whenever you turn the key off, in my case, I have to pull it back. I pull it back a little, it turned off. And if I pull it in, it turns on, makes this sound and says Bluetooth mode. Bluetooth mode. So now I can connect my phone with it. And if in like 10 seconds or 15 seconds I don't connect like any Bluetooth devices, then it will switch automatically to the SD card. So let's wait a bit. It will switch automatically to SD card. Play by TF card. Play by TF card. Um, Bluetooth mode. Bluetooth mode. And here is available devices, USB kit. Let's press on it should make an, uh, some sound that is connected connecting and connected and for example now whenever I, I, I take it off for example now I turned off the car right now I turn back the car on 
and let's see here i'm not gonna Bluetooth mount. let's see here if it's gonna connect automatically I'm not gonna oh it's connected automatically so if you have your bluetooth on on your phone then it will connect automatically whenever you turn on your car now let's go to youtube for example and as you can see it's playing you can raise from here lower it down or from the car now you might say but oh wait this kind of stays a bit outside and it's maybe not so beautiful it's a bit ugly wherever you have the cigarette lighter you can plug in this uh, this adapter you just need to take the aux cable to that location it can be in your trunk it can be here in the middle or if you have an usb like i don't know somewhere here around wherever you have an usb you can hide this thing there you just you don't even need to use this uh, if you don't if you don't want an uh, SD card and you just want the Bluetooth wherever you have the USB you can put this thing there and it will work just fine well this was an easy trick to do of course you have to have the AUX option and an USB just to plug it in it's the easiest trick and easiest way uh, if you have those things if you don't have AUX like I said you're gonna have to use a radio FM transmitter which radio FM transmitters they also have like not all of them but they also have like a SD card reader and Bluetooth to connect your, with your device but like I've said whenever you go into tunnels you're gonna hear that and not all transmitters are good I tested already like three or four and in all of them you can hear that like radio like FM in some you can hear less and some you can hear more but it's still there uh, but uh, of course if you don't have AUX uh, then that's the only solution for you which is also cheap this USB adapter I searched it online so much and I couldn't find like any that was close to it because I wanted Bluetooth and I wanted SD card reader or USB reader uh, so I can plug in a, a USB flash I can throw my music on the SD card or USB flash and it's easy because my radio has only CDs and that's it. I can connect my phone, I can I can have music from SD card. It was very cheap, it was like under $10. Uh, I bought it from AliExpress or something like that. I'm gonna try to search the link and leave it. The, I'll leave the link on the description. And believe it or not, the music is pretty damn good. But yeah, thank you guys for watching and see you in the next time.